Adventure is always alive in Breckenridge, Colorado. We're going to take you on the mountain for some screaming adventure and then show you a couple ways to quench your thirst after at the Breckenridge Distillery and with a unique take on cocktails at Modus. Orion is the owner of Snowcapped Sled Dogs. How did this unique idea start? This idea came about six years ago. We wanted to find something for the dogs to do in the summer to keep them in shape, to keep them healthy, and get them a chance to run. We started with the dog scooter here, and we found that we needed to keep the line out of the tire. Mm -hmm. Now, especially for be beginners, it's important to make sure that you make things as safe as possible. So I invented the tug and tow here, and what it does is it keeps the line out of the tire, so that as a beginner, you don't have to worry about that line getting sucked into your tire. If I wipe out, I hope we get this on camera. What a rip. My heart definitely racing right now. I'm really happy. We're stopping to let the dogs take a water break. From rolling terrain, open meadows, and even some off-roading with some really rocky portions, you'll cover a lot of ground and even pick up some mud. And my favorite part, helmet hair. Another way to experience the beauty of Breckenridge is by bike. Whether you're at the pump track or the backcountry trails, Breck Bike Guides will get you all geared up. Sydney and Nick are the owner of Breck Bike Guides. Both are professional cyclists. You guys offer skills clinics. Who do you suggest these for? Anybody, really. I mean, it could be a brand new rider, or it could be an experienced rider that just wants to take it to a next level. It could be really anything for, you know, just to get on a bike from the very beginning or all the way up to you know, trying to fine tune some skills so at a high level. I rode a bike before, but I want to learn how to do a wheelie. I can come see you guys. Well, definitely. And you guys also offer tours of the mountains around Breckenridge. Why take a tour? We can tell you how to get to a trail, but there often you'll have five to 10 intersections before you even get to where you want to start. So to have the local knowledge, make sure you're on a trail that suits your skill level and gives you the ultimate amount of fun. Swapping out bikes for sleds, I'm ready for another dose of adrenaline. This time at the Alpine Super Slide, let's take the track. Let's just say I'm glad there are brakes. These tracks you can pick up to 24 miles an hour of speed and there's 2,600 feet of tracks. Time never flew by so fast. After so much adventure and screaming on the Alpine slide, a drink is in order. The clever saying at the Breckenridge Distillery is we used to mine for gold, now we just win it. This is where both Breckenridge bourbon and Breckenridge vodka are created. Jordan is the master distiller. Why is Breckenridge the prime spot for a distillery? Well, this beautiful snowmelt water coming off the uh, off the mountains is just so rich in, in minerals, uh, vitamins, and all these uh, things that are normally added to the uh, to the water for fermentation. We get it all uh, right from nature. For us thirsty folks, what can we come in and sample here? We mainly focus on bourbon here, but we uh, also make vodka. We do a Alpine bitters that's actually uh, Many of the herbs are harvested right up here in the mountains in, in Breckenridge. We're always making some little thing around harvest time. We do peach and pear brandy, and uh, there's a lot of fun little things if you come out and visit the distillery. Make sure to stop in for a free tasting. You can also hop on a tour and watch as the spirits are mashed, fermented, and distilled. Cheers. One way to experience Breckenridge Distillery's bourbon is at Modus, where Dustin and Jesse, the lead bartenders, are making some really creative cocktails. One of them is a flamed old fashioned. So this combines peaches, oranges, and Lissardo cherries, and it's flambéed with the bourbon. Justin and Taryn are the owners of Modus. How do you guys come up with the recipes for such creative takes? Well, we um, read a lot of books. We do a lot of research on the different prohibition drinks that there were and take a lot of inspiration from the crowd around us, the world around us. Do you guys each have a favorite cocktail? Mine would be the Papa Doble. 
Uh, that would be Ernest Hemingway's favorite drink. And he famously drank 16 in one night. I'd probably say not another bourbon drink. But I know you always do have another. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, I'm sure you guys strive to use as many local ingredients as possible. Absolutely. Anything we can get from the Breckenridge bourbon to the Breckenridge vodka. Uh, we get our pork from a company in Denver called Tenderbelly, which is amazing. We do Colorado lamb. We get um, whatever we can find that's a Colorado product, we use it. There is no question adventure is always on the agenda in Breckenridge, Colorado. For more ideas as well as lodging options, check out gobrack.com. And as always, stay tuned to catchcarry.com for more ways to experience and explore Colorado.